Hi, today we are going to demonstrate how to do vitamin D test. This is pack of mycosin vitamin D rapid test kit. This is the foil, this is the lens. This is the perfect. So, firstly, we have to open the foil. bit if required turn off the lancet take off the head of the lancet now the lancet is ready here is the patient sample just one small print of blood directly put on the well now take the swab wipe off the blood to avoid Now the sample has been done, right off, just push off two drops of the foil. Hi, now we have done five of the samples with the five of the different patients and five tests, right? So how it comes? This is the one test and they have shown efficiency. So vitamin D in this patient is efficient and test has gone perfectly all right because the adequate quantity and sufficient quantity of the blood and the buffer has been put and timing was perfect. So the background is clear and test line is perfectly all right. In this case, there was a slight higher quantity of the blood sample that is why the background is red because of the high volume of the blood sample but the test is negative here there was slightly high number of sample but test is negative and at the same time background is slightly red this is also the same sufficient vitamin D is available in the patient and because of the higher sample the background has come this, this time because of this see this is correct number of sample and test is correct and background is white this is having a red background because of the higher number of sample but no problem here in this case the sample is low, buffer is low, test has not run. So put sufficient or put one drop more also, there is no problem. If you put more number of sample, it will come like this. If you put less, this will become invalid result. So put correct sample, you will get the result like this. Or if, if there is any difference, it will come like this. No problem with the test and kits are negative. So one control band shows, one line shows efficient number of quantity of vitamin D.